Tonight, we are hearing from a neighbor who tried to rescue a five-year-old boy from a burning home. Good evening, everyone. I'm Russ Bowen. And I'm Liz Ortiz. The tragic fire started just before 8.30 this morning at a house along Murphy Road in Cumberland County. CBS 17's Justin Moore has been following this story all day. He joins us live with that harrowing rescue attempt by neighbors. Justin. Yeah, we talked to Robert Kelly. He said he was having a bowl of oatmeal this morning when he heard screams. He instantly knew he had to do something to help. And all of a sudden I heard screaming, so I went out my front door, and when I looked to the right, I seen flames coming out of the front window. That fire was coming from this Eastover home on Murphy Road. Robert Kelly says he wasted no time dashing over to his neighbor's home to help. It was a really, like, scary situation. Person on fire, 4801 Murphy Road. Kelly says that person was a grandmother holding an infant, both with burns. They told us there's a five-year-old in there. Kelly and another neighbor tried to save the child who was trapped inside. We were basically just, like, throwing bricks through the window. The fire was just too strong. Firefighters managed to get inside, but it was too late. The patient's been located. He's just decent still in the house. It was a scary, eerie feeling to know that there was a kid in there. You know, um, especially being autistic, it's really scary for them. And we really just wanted to save him. The child's grandmother was taken to the hospital with injuries. The infant was airlifted to UNC in Chapel Hill, while a firefighter was sent to the hospital with facial burns. It's very heartbreaking. Now, fire investigators are still working to determine the cause of this fire, but they said it started in the kitchen area. Now, as of this evening, there are crews here at the house uh, boarding up the house, uh, so nobody will get inside. Live in Eastover, Justin Moore, CBS 17 News. A very, very hard way for that community and family to start the new year and a long recovery ahead for, for everybody. Justin, thanks for that.